But first, we want to get right to that breaking news on this Friday morning out of Providence, and it really could impact your morning commute. 12 News reporter Kate Walsh joining us live. She has the details on what happened overnight on 95. Well, I just spoke with the Rhode Island State Police about an hour ago. They said that they had to close down 95 North, just north of Elmwood Avenue, and that it's expected to take some time. It's because they're trying to remove a tractor trailer off a guardrail and then off the highway. So take a look at this video from earlier this morning. State Police say the tractor trailer crash happened just before 1 this morning north of Elmwood Ave, right near the Roger Williams Park Zoo on 95 North. It was a two-car crash, and you'll see the other vehicle in a moment. But look at this. The cab of the truck is dangling off the other side of the guardrail. Now, below the guardrail are railroad tracks, and our crew there said there was an investigation going on there, too. State police say it's going to take some time to get the truck removed, and we also see in the video that the trailer was full of pallets of frozen items, but no word on what they were. Most importantly, we're awaiting word on injuries in this crash to drivers or anyone else involved. State police could not give us that information just yet. We also saw crews from the Rhode Island Department of Transportation as part of the investigation there on scene. So we're hoping to get another update for you, especially as this is going to impact likely many people who are trying to get to work uh, in the Providence area this morning. So for that information and detours that are in place, let's go to traffic reporter Melissa Sardelli. Melissa. Thank you so much, Kate. Yeah, that video really just giving you an idea of how serious that crash is at, this morning. If you're heading out the door, 95 North, as we've been mentioning, is closed right over at Route 10 due to that crash. And the crash happened about 1 o'clock this morning. The highway has been closed for over an hour now. So if you're headed this way, you're dealing with a little bit of slowdowns even leading up to Route 10. Then you're going to be detoured off the highway so you can take Route 10, Elmwood Ave, if you're trying to make your way into Providence. We had some overnight construction that just cleared on 195 West at Gaino Street exit now back open, but really difficult driving conditions with all the ponding, the roadways just soaked this morning, myself kind of slipping around a little bit, hydroplaning, so really need to use some caution this morning. You can see just how heavy the rain is coming down at this point, so you need to take it slow. Back to you.